Hey, I'm Jeff. And I'm Molly. And we're, and we're Jeff, Jeff and, and Molly, Molly Outdoors. wilderness with our grandson Hunter and we're gonna break him in to be able to see what it's like to be backpacking in the wilderness aren't we Hunter you yes, looking forward to it yes ma'am yes well, let's get on with our adventure supposed to get thunderstorms until tomorrow, but them clouds are looking <laughs> kind of ominous. Well, the ones behind us are worse. Yes. So, we'll see. In the Lawrence County, Alabama, which is so where we're going to be camping and hiking. So this is Woods, Tennessee. There you go, baby. Nice. Thank you. All right, guys, we got our hike in. Uh, we stopped at, this is the second camp spot we checked out. The first one didn't have enough spots for all three of us to hang. This one does, but it has a little bit of a slope to it, so it'd be a little bit rough uh, getting in and out of hammocks. Uh, Jeff went on ahead. He's gonna go ahead and look for another camp spot. Uh, Hunter and I stayed here. We hung packs and we're just waiting. So we're going to go ahead and 
wait and see if this is where we're going to make our camp for the next couple of days or if we're going to put our packs back on and head on down the road. Okay, y'all we got camp set up Jeff went down and gathered some water and we got some water filtered one bottle starting on the second bottle Hunter's been dragging some firewood Ugh. and he acts like he's a 70 year old trying to do it <laughs> it's so hard <laughs> and we're just gonna sit back and just relax a little bit and oh, about Three more hours, we'll be getting us some lunch together. We've been hearing thunder boomers off in the distance. Had a few showers. Had a few showers here and there. It's supposed to start thunderstorming this evening, and it's supposed to thunderstorm cleared about four o'clock tomorrow. So we might be buckled down in camp all day. There's plenty of room on one end of my tarp here that we could even sit in if we needed to, so we'd be together. But so far, so good. <laughs>
Okay, Hunter. What do you what do you think about your first day out backpacking? First day out backpacking, um, one new too hot, a lot of work. Takes the whole team for a camp, don't it? Yes, ma'am, it does. I mean, a little bit of half and half, a juicy half and half. Well, what all have you done today? Picked up some sticks for the fire over there. Uh, did my camp, went all the way up those hills and looked for sticks. I got a little bit of free time and played uh, down in the river. Hanged out with Mimi and Poppy. Pretty good. Pretty good day, huh? And with Cheyenne, she's grown at me. Well. And you're getting ready to go to bed in what? My hammock. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're all down for the night. Everyone's in their tents and in their beds. We're all tucked in, and we will see you in the morning. Good night. Oh, we hear somebody in here wanting out of bed. Let's go in here. Hi there, Hunter. Hey. How are you? Trying to get out. How'd you sleep? Like a rock. Like a rock? Uh-huh. <laughs> Did anything scare you last night? I felt like that tree. Can you show, show the tree? Uh -huh. That tree, I felt like it was going to go into that lake down there. And I was going to, and that part was going to snap and I was going to go with it into the lake. And into the river? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it would. a rock and all that. <laughs> They're not dead trees. It wouldn't do that. <laughs> well, if they would. They wouldn't. <laughs> I feel like I'm too heavy for them. Nope, you're not. But you slept good? Good. Mm, you said you slept like a rock. Half and half. <laughs> slept hard, barely even moved that night. Nice. Okay. Enough. We had a pretty good town pour last night. <laughs> and so much it got really bad one time that Cheyenne even jumped and screamed and came up and grabbed a hold of me because she sleeps with me. <laughs> she was scared last night. Jeff already got up this morning, gonna walk. He went down to gather some water for us to filter. We got a liner so that we could gather a lot more water at once so we can take less trips because it's a drop off where you gotta get down to the river where we're at. He fills up the bag and brings it back up. We tighten the tree until we're ready to filter it. We do have our Sawyer and we have a gravity bag. And we gravity filter it right into our bottles. And it seems to be working really good. I like it whenever we, we had one camp here in Sipsy that I loved. I mean, we had water right in the camp. <clears throat> So he's able to just walk right down to the water. It had a uh, a bluff that we camped up against, and and it was really nice. Hey, y'all. Well, we've had a thunderstorms last night and a, a deluge, and today it's raining pretty good. We're just kind of staying out of the rain right now, but here in a little bit we get enough water. Hunter and I is going to go on down, take a take a little hike, just a couple mile round trip, something easy. Not even going to take a, our ba our backpacks or nothing like that. Just going to take our poncho in case it starts raining too hard and then uh, go down check out Fat Man Squeeze and 
going down the river. There's another spot I want to check out down there on the on the 90s, and then we'll we'll come back up this way, come back through Fat Man Squeeze. And I don't know, maybe we'll take a side trip and go check out a waterfall. I think Hunter would like that up to 209, and uh, hopefully hopefully he'll have a good time. So we'll check back in with you later. good uh, guys took off they went on down to fat man squeeze so hunter could see it cheyenne and i stayed here we're just gonna lay up in the hammock and until they come back it is still raining it is pouring it down but let them go and let them enjoy themselves and we'll see them when they come back Think of that. I like it. Hey. Don't don't shine your light in the camera, but what you think of that? I liked it. You like that? Yes. Okay. Step on out. Okay, you gonna let me go? Yes, sir. Let me see if I can pick away here. Let's see if it's not washed out. Mm. Mm.
Ah, it's raining pretty hard here today in the Borden Creek Valley or the Trail 200. We have had a great time. Hunter really liked going through Fat Man Squeeze. And uh, he's expressed a desire to turn around and go back. And we're going to press on just a little bit. He's You having a good time, Hunter? You are good. All right. So we're going to hike on down this way just a little. I want to make it down to the 90s. That's what I call them. I don't guess there's probably a name for them, but the Borden Creek makes a couple of 90 degree turns. I want to check out a spot down there. If we make it that far, I don't know. We had a couple of places that was washed out, which is normal. We had to do go around a little bit, but it is coming down as you can probably tell. What did you think of Fat Man Squeeze? Fat Man Squeeze. Um, it was tight at the end of it. Did Not you? the whole thing. There was no snakes. No, nothing. There was also a little crackway at the middle. Or it goes like that. Then mm -hmm. there was like a crackway at the middle. Yeah, I think it was pretty good. I like it. You liked it? Pretty cool, huh? We also saw, saw a cave. You saw the bluffs were weird? Why are they weird? Because they, I never seen them before. They look like great Grand Canyons. <laughs> they look like what? Great Grand Canyons. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> if that's what you think. Hey, um, we're just sitting here waiting for the rain, but we just ate lunch, sitting around. Don't know what we're gonna do after. We're gonna have to see about that. Yeah, we've just been showing. Watching the creek, talking to each other, me, 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 and me, and things are doing pretty good. Poppy got in the hammock, Cheyenne, come here. She's like, I hear Poppy, not you. She's doing good, awesome. She's getting all wet chasing millipedes, huh? Yeah, she's getting wet, all wet chasing millipedes. The a million legs, get it? Million, millipede, centipede, millipede, mm -hmm. yeah. I forgot how many uh, legs a, that a centipede has. I think it's 24 maybe. I don't know. I think it's 50. I don't know. You can probably yell at us through the screen. <laughs>
Okay, we got camp packed up. We got a storm in the distance getting ready to come in. So, check camp. We didn't leave nothing. Took all of our own trash. Took everything out. Hunter is packed up. We're even taking Hunter. We're even taking Hunter with us. What do you think of that? <laughs> Cheyenne, are you ready to go home? Ready to go home? Are you ready? Tell me. Go home. Go home. Follow daddy. Go. Everybody follow. And we're heading to the truck. We got three quarters of a mile up the hill. And we will be to the truck and we'll make our trek home. One last look from a different angle. We left nothing back here. All right. Lunch. What you got to got now? Tuna Creations Ranch type. And Munchy Cheetos crackers. Nice. What you got, Poppy? Jalapeno tuna and Munchy crackers. All right, y'all. Listen, we've had a great time. Three very rainy days, stormy, thunder and lightning, and uh, just a great time all around. Uh, let's see, had a fella we had to help out, got his horse trailer down in the ditch. Uh, that was kind of interesting. But uh, all in all, we had a good trip. It was good to be with Hunter, and Hunter did pretty good. And uh, Lord willing, we'll see you again on the next memory. And remember, like, share, and subscribe. And join us again at Jeff and Molly Outdoors for our next adventure. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye.